Good day, I'm Luis Campos, president of Acuaume Agricultures. We are welcome you all to the Conaqua 2020 event. This year, due to the pandemic, it was decided that it's going to be virtual. They are good topics, good speakers, international at the international level, national. I'm happy that you are here, and I hope that you like this event. Thank you to the sponsors that uh, had been participating on the event, and welcome you all. Dear friends and aquaculture colleagues, this year it's been a difficult year, and given the impossibility to get together physically con agua and con afab, do an effort so all of you have the opportunity to keep the interest on this event with conferences, high-level conferences, and an area of a stance in, vir in a virtual way. Even with the difficulties that have been presented on this long pandemic, it's worth recognizing that all the sector has been able to respond and not just keep the volume on the production, but has been increased in a very consistent way. Uh, compared with the economy and the all together. I'm sure that the primary sector will have this year a growth, a very good growth, and this year that we are in the production of the animal protein, we put our little help there. On regards to the shrimp, one of the main factors that has hit the sector are the low prices that they come within the investment. The level of demand world and worldwide has decreased as has not allowed that the prices reach the levels that they should have. Hopefully, little by little, the recovery will come in sectors as important as the hotels and the restaurants that are part important of this uh, sector and they need the shrimp and they will increase the prices. For yours truly, as president of CONAFAB, it's worth mentioning the great effort and dedication of the producers, technicians, researchers, and all the personnel of the production chain of the shrimp on the farms. On this virtual way, we are going to have the chance to reach a lot of people in several parts of the world, and we'll keep the interest and make the interest in our event bigger. Those of us who have the privilege to be pre in presence on the last edition of 2018, we were able to attest that there is a huge interest in this event and a great potential on the business on this area. For the industry of the balanced food, it's a privilege organized together with aquacultures of Ahome, this important event. I want to take the opportunity to give a greeting to the directives. Our friends, Luis Campos, Ramses Chavez, Alberto Soto, and Fernando Espinosa. I give all of you Welk I welcome you all to this event, and as always, the conferences are elected very carefully to give all of you and to provide all of you the better selection of topics and the presenters and the speakers. As for that is going to be good for technicians or people that make the business decisions, I invite you to visit the commercial area where you will find several products and services as is been always on the presidential way. I only have to say thank you and welcome you all to Konaka Virtual 2020. Thank you your presence and your time. Hopefully that next year we will be able to come back to the presence forum and I'll see you face to face to hands you to check your hands. Now I let um, give word to Marcelo Costello, current president of um, CONAFAB for the aquaculture balance the aquaculture foods, who is going to present you with a brief message. Thank you so much. How are you, my friends? Welcome you all to this new event, 
2020 of Conagua is an event that has been established very strongly within the agriculture industry and locally in Mexico, especially in the northwest of Mexico, in central Mexico. It's been an effort of many, many years, and each year we want to do new things, improvise, add value to your operations, and this year, well, it's been one of the more complex years to achieve that. Of course, we've been marked by the pandemic. This is going to make us uh, uh, have the great problem of not being able to see each other pre in presence. This event has been characterized for several things. One of them is the quality of the speakers, the commercial, the expo. And moreover, in the networking that we all together at the end of the year, we are in an industry, especially in the stream in the Northwest, that we have this estacionale. At the end of the year, we got together the providers and the producers, talk, share results, what worked, what did not, and provide new strategies for next year. That part of the networking won't be able to do this Pre this year in presence is going to be difficult, but the effort, the effort of Conagua 2020, 2020 is a standing is going to be one of the Congress with one of the curriculum more strong, powerful because the good part of this uh, of this pandemic is that allow us to discover these tools and we can bring to you speakers from all over the world and when it's in presence. It uh, took a lot of resources, time, money, and now you are going to see there's people from very impressive people that is going to add a lot of value. Well, this is what uh, I want to share with you. Thank you, thank you to the organizer, to my colleagues from the technical committee. We spent a lot of hours trying to put together this program. We hope that is uh, useful, uh, as we know that is going to be and to the organizers of CONAFAB, the confederation where we participate, as we um, mean all the food plants that we come into with to this confederation to solidify our market or industry and being able to have an industry of balanced food stronger and more healthy than the one that we have in Mexico. There's nothing else to be said. Go on. And we are here at your service to answer your questions. And uh, no, nothing else. Enjoy it. Enjoy this event that I'm sure is going to be the best Conagua event 2020 that we have done so far. Thank you so much.